very excited about my team. We've got, you know, Scotty Scheffler, who's actually relatively local here in Texas, uh, who was the U.S. Junior Amateur Champion this year, and then uh, Allie McDonald, who is the North and South Women's Amateur Champion this year, uh, the Western and Eastern Amateur Women's Champion, Ashlyn Ramsey, and then Jordan Ibrugi, who is a member of the Walker Cup and also the U.S. Pub Links Champion. So incredible credentials, but also incredible young you know, men and women that are excited to represent the United States. So I'm so excited to be their captain. Talk about this experience as compared to when you played. Um, I think I'm more excited now because I know what's coming. Um, I think, you know, when you've arrived, you don't really know what to expect when you go up to Camp Olympia and Whispering Pines and what an incredible experience it is and how nice it is to, to really get to know the players you're competing against and how many fun activities there are at night, every night. And I think I'm excited because I know what's coming and I know how much fun it's going to be. Um, so I'm just glad to be back. I, you know, I had so much fun in 2005. I was so honored and excited to be named captain that I'm just thrilled for this week to happen. And how is your, how, where's your career gone from 2005 to 2013? So, how has your career helped? half a dozen or so LPGA Tour players, when they found out I was captain, you know, came up to me in the locker room and said, "Congratulations! That's so exciting! You get to go back!" And I'm like, "I know, it's very exciting." And so, it was, it was a starting point in my career um, as far as when, when it became a high level, turning into a professional athlete. Um, sort of thing. I always considered it kind of my senior capstone moment where I could go and just have fun and play against the best players in the world um, without it really feeling like it's a life or death, like it was a get to represent my country and do it. Um, so it was, it was always a, a unique experience for me when I think back on to my amateur career. And, your, and the camaraderie amongst the LPGA and people you meet here and there, how is that? Well, like I said, I mean, I had Yanni Sen and Nayan Choi and Fli Fli Felicity Johnson from England that was actually on the team that beat us on the U.S. team when we played back in 2005. Jessica Corda, you know, all these other players that weren't even the U.S. players. They all played for international teams come up to me and say, I can't believe you get to go back and be the captain again. And so I, I'm excited. It was neat to hear that obviously this event has touched their lives in a very similar way that it touched mine. So. Um, it's just going to be a great week. And what's your expectations for tonight? Are you excited for opening series? Oh, I can't wait. I mean, this is just the beginning, and uh, they just, the, the athletes here that are competing just have no idea how much fun this week's going to be. So I'm just, I'm excited for them. Okay. And what's the spirit mean to you personally? Personally, I think, you know, golf's such an international sport, and I think the spirit international is captures it in a way that is not only global, not only highly competitive, but in a, a very much a sportsmanship um, type of way. That it's really all about building and, and having relationships with the other people that you compete against. And I think that's, that's what's so special about the spirit.